Welcome to Support Videos. My name is Douglas Barreto and today I'm going to show you how to fix the issue unable to find type when generating workflow for SQL Server sources. You get an error unable to find type when generating TDM workflow for SQL Server sources. Uh, the solution is to use the user defined type properties file in mapgen config. In TDM 961 hotfix1, this may occur for some uh, data types in SQL Server such as var binary max. So here I have a project where I have already imported the table. And this table has a var binary max column. As you see here, it imports import the data type as var binary max. I created an entity with this table and then tried generating a workflow with a plan, regular subset plan. And when I execute the plan, I get the following error, uh, workflow generation failed, unable to find type var binary max. This is a known issue in TDM 961 hotfix1, there's a CR red raise it for this. As workaround, you can use the user defined type proper file to replace the data type. Um, username like this, Microsoft SQL Server UDT native conversions dot properties in this folder, uh, TDM home utils map gen config. If you open the, the file, you're going to see some configuration for varchar, any varchar max, var binary max, numeric with no precision date time to, to. These are the known data types that caused the issue so far. After setting the file, you can come back here in the TDM workbench and regenerate the workflow. So you can see that after the changing, the workflow is generated successfully and the data type is replaced by the valid one in the mapping. So when you get an unable to find type in the workflow generation, uh, you can use this workaround to use the user defined type properties file in mapgen config. Uh, these are the known data types that cause the issue. You can see all these details in KB article 335-436. Thank you.